<laughs> something must have called you to that because you obviously advocate for small businesses. You like the maybe that the little guy mentality. And I think we'd probably agree that small business drives so much of our economy and it was founded. You think of immigrant, the immigrant mindset, they would come and they would create these small businesses and they were so important for their families, for the community. That's how we got here. And a lot of those small businesses became some of the biggest companies in the world today, right? But they started somewhere. They started out of their garage. They started in some warehouse. They just figured it out. But then all this happens, a pandemic comes and we start hearing about there's going to be a PPP loan. There's going to be opportunity for small businesses. At what point did you say, let's get into supporting and getting and helping out between the lenders and the small businesses that need the community that needs access to these loans as quickly as possible? When did that happen for you? Yeah. So the pandemic hit, it was about mid-March. And within about a week, Congress was talking about passing the CARES Act. And they outlined this the stimulus package for consumers and small businesses, small businesses being the Paycheck Protection Program, allowing every small business owner in America to get access to a loan. As I started to really think about that, I was watching kind of the market around us, seeing other lenders and other players uh, saying, we're just pausing lending. We're going to sit on the sideline. We're going to wait it out. And they did layoffs and furloughs. And it was kind of the preserved cash. It was the safe route. As I was looking at it, I realized every business owner in America is going to need a loan and they're going to need someone to help them. And you're going to have to leverage technology to be able to accept the applications online and match them up to a lot of lenders. And I think this is an enormous opportunity. And there's way more unknowns than knowns. And this is an enormous risk. And we just raised a round of capital. So we have fresh capital, but I didn't want to just go burn it all, taking a shot. But as I studied it out and realized, you know what? This is our moment. I sent a text to our board where I basically declared to our board, I want to go for it. And it was a Winston Churchill text or quote. It says this, to every man or woman, there comes in his lifetime that special moment when he has figuratively tapped on the shoulder and offered a chance to do a very special thing unique to him and fitted to his talents. What a tragedy if that moment finds him unprepared or unqualified for that which would be his finest hour. And I said, hashtag art moment. And I said, we're going for it. The opportunity is too great. The moment is extremely exciting. And there are millions of business owners that need help. Someone's going to do that. It might as well be us because we're prepared for this moment. We were tapped on the shoulder. And then I started rallying our organization and said, we need to help as many small business owners as we can. And again, we had no idea what that meant. We didn't know what the risk we were going to take. But the story that came from there where we literally almost crashed and burned like five times and put it all on the line. But it was an amazing, amazing experience and one that was 10 times harder than anything I've ever done in my career, but 10 times more meaningful, no question. 